Faras Rafal from FGR Architects here today talking about Salmon Residence. So we're in Essendon, the northwestern side of uh, Melbourne CBD. Quite a leafy green area out here and quite large uh, allotments. We're surrounded by some beautiful greenery and vegetation, so there's a lot of borrowed landscape through here. There was an existing traditional home on this property um, that was demolished and we conceived the design for a double storey residence that can cater for their grown family. The front courtyard is a very important part of this whole home, so it's fairly brutal. There's the volume that sits above and then there's the horizontal precast wall. Before you get to the entry door, you're then surprised by this beautiful courtyard, sort of the pond with a tree that sits right in the middle of it. Then the door opens up and, and then the wow hits you from there. As we enter through, we've doubled the volume as you come in. We've put a big sheet of glass above the entry door and that allows some of the morning sun to make its way straight through down the corridor. The side drops about three metres from front to back. So we had to deal with that terrain change and we've segmentally done that through. So we've got the front yard, the front part of the home, the connecting part, the living, and then the backyard. And the whole idea was as a young family, kids could be there and the parents could be entertaining, but the, the sound transfer is not sort of going straight through the home. The other importance was ensuring that we get a maximum height in that living space that we're in. So we, we were able to achieve a 3.6 metre ceiling height through this back area. And that's, that's imperative to the sense of size and space within this uh, room. Concrete's sort of the, the backbone of maybe the brutal settlements here. The kitchen bench has gone to concrete. The floor is a terrazzo concrete finish. External paving is concrete. The home is in a concrete finish. What this does, this, this provides a beautiful base for vegetation to grow on it, for furniture, artwork, just expression of many other things that, that can come around it. We've been able to use the timber to just soften certain um, areas up, so we've used that on the staircases, and I find that that is just a nice run from concrete to timber to concrete. The importance of concrete and glazing here is vital, and the detailing of that was sort of very important to get right. The most dynamic part of glazing in this home is really in the back volume, in how we bring in the morning sun, how we bring in sort of the greenery through the glass, and how do we bring in the afternoon northern sun. We've got a four panel opening, which is almost eight metres wide, that is bringing inside and outside together. We really rely on contractors like Thermaco to be able to execute the vision that we have. At no point were they against the large expanse of glass, the stackable doors, and back then not many people were doing this. FGR approached us at the design stage of this project and wanted to really push the limit and see what we could achieve with our product. We believe that the window system shouldn't really be a limitation on the design intent. The intent was to make the windows in some ways disappear. They should be seamless and incorporated into the home and feel like part of the home. The windows and doors need to be functional, they need to perform, so it's important to consider all of that when designing a home and with the Thermico product and the thermally broken range that we have, it enables the brief to be met from, a, from an energy efficient point of view and from also an aesthetic point of view. The play of the natural sunlight going through the home during the day can immensely change the feel of this space. And then it can tick over into the evening where this beautiful artificial light comes in and then there's this nice soft warmth tone that runs through the whole space. The pavilion is the focal point of the home and so it's such an important space to make sure that the beautiful landscaping and the pool and the fire pit all sort of come into the home when you've got beautiful frames and, and glass. The way this project is finished is truly world class. Uh, it's nice to work with people that have complete faith in the Thermico team and with FGR and the client in this case, really proud that they trusted us and had, had faith and belief in our system and our team. Architecture could be beautiful, uh, visual. Um, you can drive past and say, geez, that looks like a beautiful product. But my check and balance is really just coming back and just seeing the family grow through this space and just really enjoy it through the different seasons of the year to me is, is my most rewarding part.